I know very little about speedrunning, and for this video, we're gonna react to Nifsky's new world record speedrun in Super Mario Brothers. Oh, hi, Mac. What's up, Pachero fam? Welcome back to my channel, where I like to explore everything that life has to offer. This is insane. Nifsky just broke the Super Mario Brothers world record, the most optimized game of all time when it comes to speedrunning. And you can see right here, it's the first ever run to be tied with a task going into 8-4, meaning that they had a computer play the game, and then Nifsky, of course, playing it, a person, of course, and going into the last world, they were the exact same time. That is how good he is. Just going to the comments before we play it, this is almost the most optimized speedrun of all time, biggest milestone in Mario speedrunning history. I mean, his heart rate, of course, is off the charts. This speedrun is so good, it is almost the fastest possible time you can complete the game. That's how good he is. So without further ado, let's just watch it. Let's jump right into this incredible speed run. I know an okay amount. I feel like about speed running and the Super Mario Brothers speed running, at least a little bit. I've seen, um, of course, summoning salts videos and stuff like that. As far as you understand too, I feel like World 1-1 is I think one of the hardest. Yeah, Correct me if I'm wrong. I'm, uh... Boom. Just insane at 4 2 today. Let's go. I'm one for five. Super fast. Runs. But I think, you know, as far as I understand it, too, you have to get fast enough past a certain oh, time where it's like, there's something like a frame it, rule, which is similar to a bus that if you get there too early, clearly, okay, you still have to wait for another eight, bus. Two and 4 2 just swapped consistencies because, like, this should not be happening. It's so weird. See, I gotta say, too, and this one, the, the, the crazy things about speedrunning is, I think to someone who doesn't know, and even for me, I feel like I don't understand every little, like, even laying on the pipes is probably, like, pixel perfect and everything, that it looks simple or easy, maybe to, like, an average person, uh, but way harder than it looks. Also, I think you need to go all the way out and come back to get to that point, so it loads correctly, I believe, I think. But yeah, I think to, like, an average person, like, even to me, that it looks like he's just, oh, yeah, he's just running and, and jumping at random points, but it's like, no, like, everything is, like, super, God. like, Pixel perfect, especially landing on like the edge of that pipe. Every Crazy good parkour. I need this every day. I'm trying to remember how it works too. I think the route is you go one level one one, then one two, jump to world four one, four one, four two, and then eight one, eight two, eight three, and eight four. So you have to do all the levels in the eighth world. But also you can use like the skips and stuff like that. Huge shout out again to uh, Summoning Soul. He did, I think it was like a 45 minute video just about this one level of how it got so optimized. Yeah, I know you have to like, when you do that back jump, it like, I think adds an extra sub pixel oh where when you God. load it and then like oh the back God. jump off the oh pipe. Oh my God, what is happening? This is back to back. I can't, I can't, I can't. Like, what he just did in Perfect. level 4-2, oh it Dude, looked like, heck? it happened so quick, oh but I know there was, like, no so way. much going on um, in terms of him loading the vine. Then you have to do, like, the sub-pixel thing. Like, you bump into something, so you oh push more forward, I believe. <laughs> and then... Oh, my God. When you do like the back jump off I the pipe, smiling, and then the other pipe, it warps you to, like, the vine I because it loaded. It something it like that. Soon. Let's go. It is crazy that this is legit the most optimized game ever. And keep in mind, like I said earlier, if you had a computer playing this as fast as a computer could play it, just they would be easy. neck and neck right Four now. They would pretty much be two. equal. Like, I think, like, especially in this game, because it's so crazily on, optimized, Blend. even just, Blend. like, 0.3 seconds or whatever is, like, legendary in terms of, like, the jump from, like, the previous time. But like I said with the frame roll, like I said, similar like waiting, as far as I understand, it's like similar to waiting for a bus where you can only get so much faster in this game because of the frame roll. Because even if you get there faster, you still have to wait That's for that it. bus similar oh to the frame. God. Oh my God. Okay, don't freak out. Don't freak out. Yeah, I think, I don't know what it is because I think Nipsky, as far as I remember, had the last world record. Oh so he God. beat his own world record. Obviously the best Super Mario Brothers player of all time. And so he's done, I think, like tens of thousands of attempts. Like... So imagine doing this like 10 or 20,000, 30,000, 40,000 times, and then this legendary run happens. And 
And you can see that he has to land like right on that little block and then to kind of like, I don't even know what the word is, uh, to kind of like pop up to like the flag itself. So this is the last level. So keep in mind, he and an AI are the same. I know there's like, as far as I remember, a couple more time saves that can happen in this level, but I think one of them requires you to, to press left and right on the controller at the same time. So I think we can't do that. I don't know. But look at, like that job is crazy good. And then do you have to go forward and then backwards, I think? Yeah. There's no way. There's no way. There's so no way. You have to like load it or something. It's I don't know. Oh, almost there. Oh Last final part. Oh my God. It's AD. It's AD. It has to be. AD. Yes! 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 So ridiculous. Yes! Oh my god! Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! You see the chat's going crazy oh on the bottom left. 454 at 631. Absolutely insane. You can see right here the full world record being 4 minutes 54.631 seconds. And even going here, you could see this frame rule to kind of speed up time basically, was once thought to be impossible, has now been implemented in runs, and is the first ever world record to feature this final frame rule save. And as you can see here, only 22 frames or 0.366 seconds separate this run from absolute perfection, which means that at some point, whether it's Nifsky or potentially another player, who knows, will get the absolute perfect run on Super Mario Brothers. Huge shout out to him, like I said, he's done tens of thousands of runs putting in, I have no idea how many hours, how many attempts and everything. And like I said, even just like a 0.3 second jump up from the last world record is light years when it comes to this speed run, the most optimized speed run of all time. Huge shout out to Nisky. And like Cosmic commented, this is the biggest milestone in Mario speedrunning history.